Hello everybody, welcome to the four player uh, battle jam that we're having at Love Byte 2023. And this is part of our Byte Battle Extravaganza. And uh, we're ready to see four players headed on together in this awesome battle jam. And uh, let's see what we're getting. Uh, with me is uh, Oki commentating. Hello Oki. Hello, so yeah, I'm very excited for four people Byte Battle. Yeah. Uh, we have four fantastic players. Uh, Programmers, byte programmers, size byte, blah, 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 size byte programmers. Yes. I, I can't even remember what they are, but they're size biting. And they're <laughs> all size biting showing, like a maniac. Yes. Showing what they're worth and how they're going like hat to hat to hat to hat. Yes. You have Aliyah, Orbi, Mantatronic, and Tobach. Yes. Um, duking it out, and there can only be one winner. So you have to vote everybody watching, and then there will be one winner out of this incredible four way. Yeah. We've seen uh, four ways before in the uh, Byte Jams uh, that were done with the, by the Field Effects people, uh, which was just chill out, use as many bytes as you can, and uh, just uh, rock on to some, some nice tracks. And uh, now we actually have a, a four way uh, battle jam at uh, Love Byte. So, uh, yeah, this is, uh, is going to be great. Uh, our yeah. team word for today, uh, for this particular match, is uh, Arcade. And we have Crazy Q, uh, Q doing uh, the music for us, which will be uh, very blippity blippity. So this okay, is going to be good. awesome. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. And I see already Monotronic is wishing good luck yeah. to the other, other players. And I already think I see a Pong paddle on Monotronic stream. It could be. An yeah. Orby. Yeah. Orbi yeah, already has a lot of code going. That's yeah, quick. A yeah. A, a lot of code. Everybody clearly a different plan, which is fun, because then we have four. Oh, this is Tobak yeah. is uh, an error for now, but we still have a lot of time. There's only two minutes gone. So 25 minutes, four player, battle jam, extravaganza, one remains yeah. as the winner that's yeah uh, you can make that happen so vote yep for the favorite effect it's still like not much happening now but wait give it a few seconds and we'll probably see more things yeah Tobak has a few balls there we go yeah I that's correct. definitely going to be pong uh, yes very and, uh, bouncy pong <laughs> definitely so uh yeah, I'm, all, I'm, I'm curious to see what these uh, players are up to. I mean, their, their styles are so completely different. Uh, Orbi, yeah. like an old school coder. Uh, Mantr Mantratronic is always good. And Tobak, I've seen him uh, by jam a couple of times. He's just awesome. He's just doing literal stuff. I, uh, the other day, he, uh, he slept on a, on a jam and uh, he just came in and it made an effect about him uh, sleeping uh, through things, dreaming of uh, sheep, of course. <laughs> it's a fella from Wales. <laughs> yeah. Um, and Aliyah indeed doing the... Ah, high score! <laughs> Oh, that's nice. Or high, high score. Yeah. Yeah, very different approaches. Very, but it's going to be super arcadey and bleepy, and Crazy Q is going to make us all dance. Yeah. Ooh. Very psychedelic. <laughs> but yeah, distinct styles. Everybody showed themselves as, as a great coder, a great size coder, or bite sizer, as now is a thing. <laughs> A sizey um, person. Uh, a sizey person. Um, so let's see. And it's like we have to keep track on who does what because we have four people now. So there's four effects to keep track of. And two is already super stressful sometimes. So let's see what we'll have. And there are people using the the FTE sound? Yeah, yeah. Thinking. I think Montatronic is using that. Yeah, Montatronic has been really good uh, with using the FFT. Uh, I think uh, all, just... all these players, I think he is most aware of what's, uh, what's possible with it. Uh, I think he also did our sound check for, uh, to make sure that the uh, sound levels are, are equally between all uh, contestants. So, uh, yeah. Awesome. 
everybody involved. And I just saw his pong ball happily bouncing off through the paddle. So there is still <laughs> some work to be done, but we have 20 yep. minutes. Oh, I think Tobak, is he doing a Pac-Man? Oh, arcade, that's... and you get arcade as a word, and you have the tick 80, and only 512 bytes, like small yeah. sizes. You're gonna go old school arcadey. You're not Probably, gonna do yeah. table table flipping arcade game, or it's a great game. Yeah, it's a game. It's a great keyword. I mean, uh, there's yeah. lots of way uh, you can go with this, and uh, lots of classic games or, or, or styles that you can do. So uh, very recognizable, like indeed as we saw at Montatronic, is like you put a paddle on the screen and people go, ah, it's pong. Yeah. So in that aspect, it's uh, but then you also have to make it interesting. I think you can't just leave it at pong. So I wonder where he's going in the coming 20 minutes. And that is these first, these first five minutes, uh, five to like seven and a half, eight minutes are always like setting up and fleshing yeah. out. Mantratronic has a nice... Uh, <laughs> he <laughs> embarrassed himself in front of uh, <laughs> two prime ministers. Ah, two prime ministers. <laughs> Where Tobak had tea with one, I saw. So it's our ice cream uh, with one. No, I think uh, Mantratonic embarrassed himself in front of two Nobel Prize winners. So oh, Nobel Prize. Winners. Curious to see what the, the story is about behind it. Yeah, that is embarrassing. And two of them as well, like in different yeah. occasions or one. Mm, so yeah. many questions. So never many going questions. to be any answers. No answers. But a lot of code. Yeah. A lot of bite sizing. There we go. And Tobak indeed going in. Crashing across. So I don't know what Orby is doing. He has this kind of like 3D looking. Yeah. And I'm saying it and I see Mantronic's ball going absolutely bonkers. <gasps> that was really fun. Yeah. The FFT really works there. And I think that um, Aliyah is going for this really flashy high score screen. It looks very classic. Um, pinball y arcadey. Yeah. I don't know what Tobak is doing. I saw some balls bouncing on the screen as well. Yeah. Yeah, Orby is a mystery to us. What will he reveal? Now that is, and that's pretty cool because that's 18 minutes on the clock and it's just still so much time and you can like have a, have a sheet and pull it away later. I'm yeah. really loving Metatronic's absolutely chaotic energy there. <laughs> oh, I don't know what Orby is uh, making, but it looks interesting. It is very interesting. And Aliyah is going all out high score blitz. I don't think Tobak is doing Pac-Man. It seems too character. I don't know. It's like everything is going so fast. People are just running it so quickly. Yeah. No idea what's going on. <laughs> yeah. Is he doing some kind of button bashing, maybe? Is he doing button bashing? Is he doing two players versus each other? I don't oh. know. Could be anything. Could even or be. Or is he shit. doing the arcade? He's doing the arcade cabinet from, from like from above, and you have two joysticks. Mm. Montatronic still has like insane. Yeah. Ball action also bites over, but the bites are all like the bites are everywhere. They are. Less focused on the size, more focused on what the hell is happening because we have four people doing it. Yeah. It is confusing, I will say. It is somewhat confusing. I can't wait for an for eight player <laughs> bite jam. I don't know where jam. To watch anymore, yeah. Multitronic ball. Motortronic's ball seems to have calmed down. I'm a little bit sad. <laughs> it's absolutely chaotic energy with that ball. I felt that. I felt that. Uh, yeah, there's a good minutes. 60 minutes left. So, uh, yeah. We're see, Still we're lots seeing, of time. Yeah, and we're seeing, like, indeed, we're seeing the ideas being formed. And I think the most clear is Aliyah and Montatronic have an idea and running with it. Mm hmm. Um, and I wonder where Tobak and Orby are going. Orby is going all out. I wonder if he's going to make like an entire arcade. 
Ooh, it looks like yeah. a bunch of buildings now, but it's, yeah, very intense. Or he's just going to do a scene of Blade Runner and then be <laughs> done with it. It's <laughs> the entire, like, intro yeah. of Blade Runner. There you go. Yeah. I, it is really fun. Everybody's approach. I really love that absolutely <laughs> metal energy of Metatronics. I'm sorry. I'm not biased. Like, vote for the one you love the most. But I'm enjoying that little ball going. But, oh, here we go. Orby is moving. Is Orby Oops. moving or is Effect moving? Uh, Orby's just moving out? <laughs> He's moving out. Orby's moving out. <laughs> Different battle. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Score. High score. Yeah, it's, it's, I really like Aliago and I committing to like, I'm doing a high score screen. Committing to it. Yeah, I mean, it's it's a difficult thing. You get you get this keyword and we yeah. we literally just give the contestants the keyword right before the match. So yeah. they, they really don't know what they're up against. So yeah, you get this keyword and then go, go, go. And there are three yeah. other players and uh, you have to run with it. So uh, yeah, you can, but you can't do it wrong. Like this is just like to, to keep it flowing. Yeah. Um, and we're not penalizing for not using the keyword. It's just like, what do you do? And I really like Aaliyah's like very classic 80s looking high score screen. So a very, very pinball machine-y, very like Vegas looking, which means too many colors. <laughs> There's no such thing as too many colors though. Yeah, I'm 14 minutes on the clock. Hmm? Yeah. I'm interested if she's able to use the uh, FFT sound input in an interesting way on this. We've seen her do it on their uh, on their 512 byte uh, match. So that was uh, so. Hopefully, she can do something similar here. I don't know. Let's see. Let's see what it will be. And that is also just as always. I'm really. Is this? It's Tobak is going. He's running as a fact for literally a second. Like we have yeah. no idea what's happening. He's, <laughs> like the, the teaser yeah. and then go like no 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 nobody's watching me go go away. Go Just away. making a fact here. Ooh. Orby is getting some 3D action going, it seems. It seems so. Very blaring high score screen from Alia. Mantratronic is just heavily coding. Mantratronic is just like you, Oki, just jo enjoying his balls. <laughs> as he does, as everybody is, always. Like, that's very good. There you go, that ball, everywhere it goes. <laughs> I see the high score is moving on Alia's screen, which looks very cool. Yeah, I'm really enjoying like these like four completely different effects. It's really yeah. hard to keep track of. Yeah. Yeah, this is the thing with the uh, Byte Battle Extravaganza. We're just uh, playing with the concepts, uh, see if there's something interesting there, and yeah. uh, hopefully uh, something nice for the audience to enjoy. And the Battle Jam is like, this is harder because you have four people to choose from instead of like two contestants. So. Yeah. Who will you vote for? You can only vote for one. So it's also kind of unfair. <laughs> then again, isn't it always? Yeah. Life isn't fair, OP. Exactly. That's why we do these bite battles. And we get a very big hi on the screen from Malia. Yeah. In 12 minutes. And we Actually, you have to keep an eye on the time because there's so much going on and you keep forgetting, yeah. like, oh, it's also timed. So oh, yeah. <laughs> Keep in account that it will end at one point. And that's like the less relaxed uh, at a bite jam. It's way more relaxed. You can just go for a while. Here it is, also 25 minutes. So, yeah. Four right delivery. Absolutely mental. But I'm loving every, like, all the performances uh, our coders are giving. I can't figure out what is arcadey about Orbeez. I can't or figure out decided... what's working about Orbeez at the moment. <laughs> I, or he decided to not go with the concept. He's like, fuck it, I'm doing my effect. But like, either way, it's fair. He's looking at some kind of 3D scene. Maybe he's maybe making... you're right. Maybe he is trying to make arcade. An arcade. He's trying to build an arcade. Like It is a very grand effect. And just having that keyword gotten... Like hearing that keyword just minutes before the round, and then it's trying to set that up. Battle against the clock, battle against the bites. Um, Aliyah just going for a all out scrolling effect. Yeah, scrolling, wobbling. 
I, I still, I'm not entirely sure what Tobak is doing. Like, he seems to be making like either a two-player game or like like joysticks and a screen. Yeah, I think he's trying to make uh, some kind of arcade cabinet with button, yeah. ba button bashing. Yeah, but it's 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 so fast, and he's just and there we go. Montrotronic is a quite sanitized version of Pong on the screen now. Ah, yeah. Yeah, Orby is starting to get form. It's an interesting effect. I haven't seen it done like this. I really like how smooth Aliyah's effect is. Like, it's really, really tweaking that, like, I'm going to make this screen. Ooh, it gets a little bit glitchy. I like that. So does Orbis effect. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he heard you. And he said, oh, a uh, glitchy one. Oh, glitchy, you okay. <laughs> Glitchy, eh? Yeah, uh, I can run with glitchy. Very trippy, very trippy. Yeah, it's nine minutes, so we're in the last ten minutes. Yeah. I'm and I can't if... wait to see Tobak's effect for longer than a second. That's going <laughs> to be amazing. Yeah, maybe you have to wait until the end. There we go. Oh, I'm okay. A little bit longer. I think you're right, indeed. It's kind of like button bashing and an effect. Oh, it's like all tied to it. Lots of different things happening there. Yeah. Yeah, I like the FTE is just really messing up the Pong, which is really fun. <laughs> Still not entirely sure. Like it looks amazing what Orbi is doing. It's kind of 3D marching kind of thing. So yeah, we're at like eight eight and a half minutes. Yeah. Enough time to go, but getting yeah. to the point where you want to start thinking about how to wrap it up. Yes. I'm interested to see if uh, Tabak is uh, trying to get anything arcadey on screen, I guess. I think he's just like, he's coding so hard and he's like, he keeps crashing as well. And it's just like, doesn't care. Just no. goes. <laughs> just goes. All in. Yeah, you don't have the time to care either. No, no, it's like eight minutes, so you really have to go. But it's, yeah, the dangerous game of crashing at the end. Yeah. Mantratonic ball, back in full effect. Yep. Kind of looking what he can still do. I think he's... Uh... Yeah. I what think else can you add to this? Yeah. yeah, ideally you want to have it go a bit beyond Pong, even though that ball is, is massively cool. Yeah. Uh, and see if you yeah what what can you add but then yeah. and what you add in like seven and a half minutes like you still have seven and yeah. a half minutes which is quite some time but also not that much yeah so it is a risk everything you add yeah like I said you, you get the keywords then you go oh yeah uh, arcade I can do pong and then where do you go from there yeah, where do you go from there exactly it is a challenge as well and then twenty five minutes is a long time. And you also don't want to stop. Like, you don't want to go, like, I'm done now, but then I'm, like, leaving stuff. I can do more. And it's cool that uh, all the uh, contestants seem to be using the FFT functionality. I mean, yeah. it, it's there. It's a new feature, but uh, you're not uh, uh, obligated to use it. So, uh, yeah. No, no, we see it in the shader showdowns as well. Like, people sometimes use it. It... Also, like it can enhance your effect, but it also can, yeah, make, make it look scale. different than you want because you yeah. don't know what the music. Is. So it's a risk as well. I yeah. think in Montatronic's case, this is very fun. So yeah, keep voting. We have six minutes on the clock. Yeah, and we also yeah. saw uh, we saw the link to uh, lifecode.demozoo.org. This is the place where you can find all kinds of live coding, uh, demo scene live coding related events, byte jams, byte battles, shader jams, uh, shader showdowns, 
everything it's there uh, yeah. you can can look back your favorite event and uh, uh, often the code is just there for you to look at so it, it's a great All site open. yeah agreed and live coding is just such a fun thing to yeah. have now and to participate to yeah, see so people participate in and to just be able to see this all being created in yeah. 25 minutes and the last five minutes coming up yeah they are going all out with the high score text giant high score text and also very um the very big wavy effect mm -hmm. i'm seeing orby i'm still like i, I can't we haven't like seen the effects enough from orby and tobak to really yeah. grasp what they're doing it's orby is just going all out big city towering in arcade city something like that i like the silhouette uh, on it yeah so it's gorgeous looking effect, like especially something that's banged out literally in like 25 minutes or 20 minutes because we still have four and a half minutes to go. And the Metatronics Pong is going all out. <laughs> <laughs> Most frantic game of Pong in the world. But nobody will ever score a point. Yeah. Let's see where Orvi is going. We're now at like indeed. I like the, the perspective on Orbi's effect. Like looking up, sort of seems. Yeah. Yeah, now it's kind of like looking down. Like he has this very looming. Oh, yeah. we have some color changes in Monotronic's effect. Still messing with it. You have the time. Yeah, he's adding a score to it, as it looks like. Ah. The, the infinite the high score. We have very colorful feedback effect there on the Leah screen. And what is our time? There's so much coding happening that I don't know how much time we have left. Uh, is it time? No, it isn't. Okay. It's probably a bit time left. We have some, but only minutes. There were only minutes left, so people will have to be wrapping it up now. Yeah, I think we can call this an inf infinite playroom, infinite arcade room. Yeah, we're getting a good look at all the different effects now. People still tweaking. I do indeed think is is Tobox just two hands playing on an arcade game. We're looking at it at the top. Yeah. We'll see. Sh we'll see shortly. When the time is running out. Oh, there's two and a half minutes. Yep. Two and a half minutes going. So we have some time. But yeah, better be ready. So I think Orby is done. It seems. Yeah, I don't know if it's Arcadia, but it looks cool as hell. So It's a great effect. Yeah, it's a great yeah. effect. No matter if it's Arcadia or not. I think we can jam it into... We can even say it's Arcadia. It looks very Arcadia-ish. Now we have a great high score screen from Alia. And I think indeed Tobak is just making somebody playing oh, <laughs> and crushing. And crushing. In the last two minutes, like, be careful, Tobak. You don't want that to be your last bite. I really like to see where people started with and what they like. Alia really, she really stuck with the high score idea. And yeah. again, as we see her do more often, iterated, iterated, iterated. So many versions of it have come by, different variations, different shapes. Yeah. I really love seeing that journey. Yeah. So back, uh, back with uh, raster bars. Yeah, he has been doing that effect on the screen, has been changing, but he does like it's very interesting take on like. Making an arcade game literally wow. being played. Yes, there's detail on Orbi's effect. Nice. Yeah, they're still tweaking. The last minute yeah. is coming up, and then they're still tweaking. There's still pretty big changes being made. And always room for improvement. That's a good attitude to have. There, it's always there's always room for improvement, but don't 
Don't pull a Gasman, as we all remember from the very first bite battle. Oh, don't remind Gasman. <laughs> it's a cross that he will have to bear forever. He was the first, and I think the only, to ever not make a, make a finish line. But also an example for everybody else. Yeah, so 30 seconds, so people will have to wrap it up. I think uh, Gasman himself refers to it as the incident. The oh. incident, <laughs> as it was. <laughs> And there we go, 24 seconds, and Tobak is crashing. Like, it is. Oh. He's, he, he makes it interesting for us. Make sure you fix this, Tobak, because else this is what we have to judge you on. Yeah. Or people will judge you on it, or won't you? And that's just very difficult. I think, I think, there we go. I think yeah. Motatronic is done. Yeah, I think and this is still where we're at. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think here we are, four effects. Yeah, yeah, here we are. We're done. Well done to still rocking that balls. Yeah. Great match, uh, great battle. So uh, yeah. vote for your favorites. There's uh, four people to, to vote for. Oh, uh, we have Elias the live coding. Oh, 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 not really allowed. Quickly go run it. There we go. Yeah. We didn't see that happen. We didn't see that happen. Now it's just all running. Yeah. She didn't really so, change anything. These have been uh, lovely, uh, Oki. And uh, thank you yeah. for, for co hosting uh, or co, co commentating a few of those uh, with me. No problem. Yeah. It was always, always, a, always a joy to be looking at the bike battle ideas and seeing people with gems. And look yeah. at this, like for effects. Shout out to Alia, Orbi, Monotronic, and Tobak yeah. for making this. And also different, but all awesome. Yeah. In a, and a very arcadey in their different ways. And it's yeah. so fun to see, especially when you have four people on the screen. It gets so chaotic. Yeah. But it even shows like it shows more how people are so different in like in what they're doing like, yeah. nobody will make the same thing and now we actually have else. some uh, now we actually have some time to have the effects breed a bit so yes. we can finally take a look at Tobacco's effect so take a look at the actually take a look at the effects vote for your favorite and there can only be one winner yeah so let's let's see uh, the other effects as well and get a good good look at them yeah for how long you have to wait during the battle yeah <laughs> finally finally yeah. we can take a look i think you're already happy okay that that uh, tobacco is away from from keywords for a few seconds now <laughs> i i am happy that i can see the effect and in my head it's two hands playing an arcade game yeah i think so yeah yeah button bashing uh, quite and it's game. a very intense arcade game <laughs> Like a Rustenberg game, and this is Orbi's yeah. effect. Yeah, nice, very cool. 3D. Yeah, yeah, good colors, like, looks really cool. So, yeah, so these these have been fun. Uh, this is, yeah, I think all the, uh, the battles we've seen have been great. Love Bite has been great so far. Uh, I, I really hope that uh, people will enjoy the rest of the evening. We've got some great compost still coming up. So, uh, yeah, lots of Jam interesting stuff still happening. And uh, who Jam knows? Jam-packed as it is. Yeah. Very good. And who knows what's coming up? Who knows what's coming up? It's always a surprise at Love Vibe, but yeah, it's been yeah. great. And look at these four effects. Take some time yeah. to take them in and go vote for your favorite. Let's get a little closer look at the bouncing pong ball from Antrotonic. There we go. <laughs> Less chaotic than before, but and I love that the score will always be zero zero. Yeah, there's something really existential in this effect, right? yeah. the infinite game of pong that was always go on. <laughs> there is never a winner. Yeah, I think that wasn't different game, wasn't it? War games. <laughs> the only winning move is not to play. Yeah. Um, I think Mantratronic is like still regretting this. <laughs> <laughs> what are we what are you watching this match uh, together with us? <laughs> no, it's uh, it's a fantastic. Yeah, I mean a fantastic execution of Pong, and then having it reacting really like very well done. Yeah. And now finally, Oki. <laughs> we have to take a look are at you ready for, it? <laughs> for a little bit longer than just a few seconds. Yeah. Yeah, give, him, give him the room to breathe. They all deserve yeah. it. Like, they absolutely yeah, yeah. deserve it. And meanwhile, people can vote, so uh, everybody and wins. 
That's the thing with the four-way battle. You have to take more time to show all the effects because there's yeah. like four effects you want to give proper attention to. Yeah, absolutely. Ooh, it's, a change, it's changing between uh, screening yeah. and, and rest of ours. It's, it's interesting. There we go. Yeah. Yeah, somebody is really hammering on those controls to make yeah. it happen. Gameplay yeah. uh, unclear. <laughs> Intense. <laughs> Maybe Tobak is just inceptioning himself. <laughs> I'd play this game. <laughs> play the uh, Tobak game. Let's play the Tobak game. But yeah, I like that this idea of like, I'm going to make this. And if it's not two hands playing a game, then please correct us later what it was. But that's what we took out of it. Tobak being like, yeah, that. no, it's two people chatting. What are you talking about? There's two people chatting, head bobbing. But well, there's music <laughs> playing in the background. The yeah. team was disco, right? No, yeah. It's, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, and, uh, but I love that he like multiple things moving on the screen yeah. and having that idea starting with that keyboard and just just uh, making this happen is awesome. Yeah, absolutely. And uh, shout out still to Crazy Q for delivering uh, the awesome tracks for this uh, for this uh, battle jam. Absolutely. So uh, yeah, go vote for your favorite. Uh, enjoy the rest of the evening. Okay, and I will say goodbye to you. Bye-bye. Goodbye. Goodbye and have a great night with the rest of the show.